Hey there, listeners. Well, Megan and I had every intention of posting a new episode this week. However, obviously, we are at the beginning of the holiday season as we recently celebrated Thanksgiving. And uh, full disclosure, the, the timing and the planning just got away from us. And so there technically will not be a new episode this week. Um, we did want to throw out a, well, that's helpful resource, which we fully intend to do. But I also quickly wanted to give a heads up. Um, we always refer back to our sister website, www.postsecondarytransition.com. That website has been seeing a lot of significant changes and, you know, sifting the information around, uh, making some information more readily available, other information more easily accessible, other pages even still, you know, kind of linked, counterlinked, cross-linked, blah, blah, blah. But anyway, um, there's been some pretty big changes there. Uh, we apologize for that, but we just want to make sure that it is the most accurate, most up-to-date information and so I even um, on the front page changed out some of the information to say that uh, essentially at this point, the, the web page, the website is a work in progress. It is under construction. Uh, we're making some big changes, but uh, needless to say, the information that's up there is sound. It is useful. There are a lot of great links, but we're continuing to make some changes and we just wanted to give you a heads up. So without further ado, we'll throw out the, well, that's helpful resource. And this time we're going to focus our attention on the My Life Learning Center. Now this is located in Ellicott City, Maryland. So this is very local for both Megan and I. Uh, this program, the this program follows the life advancement through skills enhancement. And they work to train adults with autism on sustainable life skills and job skills. And they do this by weaving in principles around micro business and STEM employment. So if you hop over to their website, mylifelearningcenter.org, you'll find their contact information, links to their Facebook page, and information that includes company news and the activities that they're doing with the adults that they work with, uh, and also uh, a little bit of information about their training, uh, or at least the training philosophy that they follow. So we think that this could be a really good resource for families who are looking for potential places to send their young adult to learn new skills and skills that they can build off of. So there will be a link in the show note, but again, mylifelearningcenter.org. Give it a look. So as always, we just want to remind you to follow the information from this conversation in our show notes. Uh, make sure to like, follow, and please, please, please share out the podcast with anyone and everyone. Visit our YouTube channel where we've posted videos of all our conversations, including doing some of the legwork for you by curating videos of topics that revolve around transition. We've created play playlists that cover guardianship, alternatives to guardianship, ABLE accounts, and still more to come. So be sure to subscribe there as well. And finally, check out our website, which is chock full of information around the transition process. And you'll find our contact information there, too. If you have any follow-up questions or any requests for podcasts, we love hearing those. So be sure to go to www.postsecondarytransition.com.